guys welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new here hi welcome my name is ruby on today's video i have an easy everyday look that is like my signature go-to look and i wanted to go ahead and do a little chit chat get ready with me because i am going to be doing a full try on a lookbook with all thrifted um, outfits and my next video so i wanted to do something very neutral that's gonna go with any color any outfit so this is it and if you want to know how i got it so i already did my brows i just filled them in and then i used the glue like the brow glue and then i filled it in i love like since cutting my brow well half of my brow off like um how they look and they're like a little bit more symmetrical before like my wing would end right here and i would look like i don't know like they were like blocky or i don't know like very pointy now they like curve slightly and i really like that i feel like it makes me look a little bit more young youth youthful um and i gave myself like a lift basically so i love that for me because i want to look like i'm young forever I got this from like a YouTuber. She well, but like hers are like shaved. She only left this part off. I can't do that because I'll be looking crazy. And on the daily, I don't want to look crazy, crazy. But let's go ahead and get ready because I have a full filming day. My baby left uh, to spend a few days with my. Uh, parents because my siblings are on spring break and they wanted her over there so i'm gonna like take full advantage to like just sh shoot video after video after video because uh when she's here i can't um i like have to focus on her and then i have to make food and i'll do all that and today it's literally a day just for me like i don't have to be a wife i don't have to be a chef i don't have to be a mom or anything like that uh, especially because we don't have groceries so there's that i'm like fasting at this point i started doing intermediate fasting so i don't even have to eat yet so i don't know why i'm like just saying random shit but okay hold on my makeup i want to show you guys like a really easy day look that can go with anything and it's super duper easy you just need like a palette with like neutrals and this is like my everyday go-to cute clean girl makeup. So I'm going to go ahead and prime. I'm going to use the e.l.f. primer. And I don't want nothing too heavy because I don't want to crease. And then during the day, I just want my makeup to look kind of nice. I have like, other than like having hyperpigmentation here, I have like, um, my skin cracks from there like I have wrinkles or i don't know and then all down here so i can't wear like too heavy because then it looks really bad <sighs> why wasn't i lucky with good skin i guess i guess we can't have everything in life uh maybe like in a few months i'll try to see what else i can do about it because what i've done hasn't really helped okay i'm gonna put oh actually let's do our eyes hurt i have to have mascara from last night okay let's do our eyeshadow first i'm not even gonna I'm not even gonna uh, put concealer or anything because I'm gonna do like a little brown eyeshadow. Like these two colors. And I'm gonna put it here. And I'm gonna flicker it outwards. I want like the cat eye look. And then bring it inwards. And I go, I try to go above my my crease um should i try like tiktok like makeup hacks on my skin since i don't have perfect skin and a lot of the 
girls that put it on there they do so we can go ahead and see if it works for all skin types like there's this girl that literally puts her foundation with her hand with her fingers okay now i'm gonna get a clean brush because it's looking muddy get this little fluffy brush actually a fluffier one this little fluffy brush I'm gonna dip into this like sand color. We're gonna go ahead and just do circular motions. Okay, so I'm not gonna do black or anything because then it's gonna make the look really heavy, but I, I do want it to be kind of brown. And then I put a little bit more of this color. There's like a terracotta color. I love this palette. You can they um I think Wet and Wild has one like a nude palette for like five dollars. So if you're just starting with your makeup, that's a really good and it blends is really good actually, like the Wet and Wild shadows. And since I'm gonna be oh so after this I'm gonna film this video um like a lookbook with all my thrifted outfits and then trying on the the Shein heels and stuff that I bought. I'm excited. I wanted to like brighten out my eye, so I'm gonna put a little bit concealer. It's like my favorite kind of look. It's like not really like a cut crease, but it, it is. I just like having the inner corner like really bright. Look, it's like cleaner with my finger than a brush at this point. Okay, love, love, love. So now I'm gonna go ahead and just set it with this light bone shade. Put it all over. This is gonna help your eye like appear brighter. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead and get my little blending brush and I'm going to blend the edge of this just to make it look nice. It's nice and blended. Okay, and that's, that's the I look. So now we're going to go ahead. I was going to put a shimmer and stuff, but I honestly am feeling this better. We'll just add some shimmer in the inner corner. For the meantime, we're gonna do a wing liner because we're gonna add some falsies. Like, like what the heck do I have here? And I guess I have my, my freaking eyeliners like all the way up there. But I like it, what do you guys think? And do I have eyeliner here? Yeah, I do. Okay. Now let's go ahead and go on my face and I need to hurry because I'll be here sitting down talking to you guys the whole day. And I have to film three more videos. Baby, tu me tienes Do you guys like that? If you guys know something, I speak a lot of Spanish and English, Spanglish. And most of my subscribers, actually, I don't think they know uh, Spanish. But if you're trying to listen to some Spanish music, some reggaeton, um, the new Karol G uh, album is fire. It's fire, fire. Fire burning on the dance floor. You know that song? <laughs> I think it's by Sean Kingstar or something. I used to listen to him a lot when I was little. Like, you beautiful girls. That all I want to do to dance. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how to go. They always want to do the work. They always want to do the dirt. You got me so. Okay. 
Can I say that? Okay. I'm going to use my bougie foundation. Well, it's not that bougie, but I'm going to use my favorite foundation, which is the NARS. I honestly need just a little bit. A little bit. I do oh, five points. That's me. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and... So I start off with the most products in the areas that I need the most coverage. And then I just go to the sides. Like, honestly, if my... I've already said this before, but if my face was all one color, I would not use foundation. I would just conceal, spot correct, and let's go. Like, I really like... My skin color and everything. See, that was that was kind of enough. And there was only like one. I'm gonna put this here, let it rest for a little bit. I really like this foundation because it doesn't feel super heavy on your face. And I am so dry and like dehydrated, but I drink so much water. I literally drink like a gallon a day. And it's still dry. But um, that's besides the point. Like, it just doesn't look crusty. It just looks like enough dewy, but not too dewy. It just looks like it's hydrating. It's got, like, I don't know. Okay, this is my favorite part, guys. Um, we're going to try a new product. So, if you see my haul. I got this from Shein. This is the Soft Tan Sculpting uh, Contour. And this is a cream contour. I have not cream contour in a minute. So I'm excited. I thought, honestly, this color was not going to go with me. Um, but it actually, it's a really good contour shade. So let's go ahead and just do some concealer first. And the concealer is going to brighten us. I'm not going to use the lighter one. I'm just going to keep it like this. I'm going to do a little bit here. I don't like putting any up here, even though like some people say to lift, just because it turns uh, the pigmentation around my mouth gray. And I don't want to look gray right now. So I'm going to go for the nose. So I do my nose first because it has the less product. That way I don't have to... I don't have like so much product on my nose. I need a good uh, facial. So my friend started going to school to become an esthetician and I'm excited. So I need an esthetician. Um, she's doing massages. She does like lymphatic drainage and all of that. So if you live in Arizona... Uh, you can look her up by Ari, uh, Sandy Arias, or I'll put her thing here, but you guys should check her out. I hope for like a weight loss. Let's see how huh? I look more lifted. I love makeup, guys. I don't wear it every day. Literally, like, I had not done my makeup or my hair in a minute, and on Sunday that I filmed, um, I was like, dang, I miss me. Like, I try not to be wretched at home, but I don't do my makeup. Just like to let my face breathe. So I now I feel like super good, but I wish I could stay like this dewy. But I have to put some. Some more. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and sculpt our face. See how I thought this color was going to be lit. I want to get some cute earrings. I'm like feeling earrings now. So I'm going to do it a little bit higher than my actual like cheeks or cheekbones, whatever. I used to like be on fleek with my, with my nose contour. But not anymore. Now, I, now you know what I have to buy. It's a really pretty, like bronzy shade. Um, just cause, 
the one I have is too orange at the moment. So we're gonna put this, hopefully my forehead looks smaller. I've never really been insecure my forehead, but my brothers be roasting me a lot about my forehead. I should have done the nose first. So far so good, it's blending like really good. So now we're gonna use this little this liquid blush never use liquid blush i just have like this putty one from elf and it's really pretty now i'm like getting so into blush and they said if it's like a orangey reddish color so they say to put it like above here How cute. I like it. It's me, Mario. <laughs> I feel like that's how it sounded. Okay, let's go ahead and blend that. Oh, there you go. It's not bad. It's not as hard as I thought it was going to be. Okay, and I'm going to put some in my nose. Ooh, 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 ooh. I should have gone in a highlighter now. I'm like feeling it. Honestly, they blend good. I was so scared of buying products from like Shein because I'm like, they come from China and I don't know what they put in it. But a lot of people like use them like a lot of YouTubers that I watch. So I'm trusting them. So then now I'm going to go ahead and start setting my face to set my under eyes. I love this one. Um, it says Chilling chilling Wonder 2115 is Sheer Envy Loose Powder Oil Control. Um, supposedly, it's supposed to be like hydrating and uh, cooling. Set my face. I really don't set anything else. Then around my mouth, just because I don't want the pigmentation to come up, I do a loose powder and I just press it in with my beauty blender. This is from Fenty Beauty. And I just press it in around my mouth. And you know what I have to buy? It is a setting spray. Like a really nice setting spray. Okay, now I feel like I need color. And like I need to bronze. So we're going to use this palette. I love I love these bronzings. I don't really use the other one anymore. So we're going to go ham because I want to look like I was just in Hawaii. Is it Hawaii or is it Hawaii? Because I've seen some people say Hawaii. I'd be saying Hawaii. It's just so bronzy. Okay, I'm going to press this down and go around. I feel like I need to go to French now. Okay, I'm literally doing my makeup with those. See? How brave am I? And I fell in love with this. I love a peachy moment. So I got this. Look at the, how cute this packaging is. It gives me like Kylie Cosmetics. Uh, um, or like um, ColourPop Vibes. Um, so then I'm going to go ahead and get a blush brush. I'm going to dip my brush and I'm going to see the mirror for this because I'm going to put some right here and it's a buildable so I just want a hint of orange don't want to look like a Loompa Loompa either I'm going to put some in my nose I love having like a pinky nose I just feel like right here you just put it like where your 
because that would actually like hit your face i love it i feel like it needs like a good lip i'm on the hunt to find a freaking brown lipstick again because the ones that i use well they're expired at this point but they're my i like would tell my friends like oh can you hold this for me in their bag like when we would go out and i never saw them again i don't know what friends actually because i'll be doing that with everybody so for the lip hold on let me put my glasses because yeah I love, uh, dude i love this makeup but i'm still recording if not i'm gonna cry okay then i do like little nude lips so i'm gonna sharpen it i hate sharpening my lip liner i need a good lip uh liner sharpener so put me on guys I literally do videos for like, I don't know, 30 minutes, like doing my makeup. And I'm like, what the heck do I talk about? But for, uh, I apparently have a lot to say. Okay, we'll do this. I'm excited. Okay, I don't really overline my lip. I just go on my shape. Literally swatch like three of them and they're like, the same tones like all nudes but one is like peachier pinkier so i want to do this it's a little bit more brown uh it's from milani this is i am pretty 05 how cute and i don't want to do a gloss but usually like daytime i would do a gloss i just need lashes and we're good to go so let's do some lashes oh and i need um a lot of mascara i just do um lashes first i'm not gonna put nothing on the bottom but i i feel like doing something and then the trick that i like know too is that you have to let it like really really dry because if you put it still kind of wet Sometimes you think like, oh, it's kind of dry already. And sometimes it's not. And it's like still hard. For the longest, I didn't want to like dress up or anything. Because I'm like, I'm fat. That doesn't look good on me. But honestly, I've been like sacrificing a lot for being fat. And I love dressing up. So I'm like, you know what? stop like you're still beautiful at any shape let's go ahead and just embrace it and yeah and then i've looked for a lot of like plus size um girls like to dress up and stuff and i don't really see my style so i'm like why not just put it on me and put it out and there feel like um extreme and feel like a thick betty so that's what we're doing I am obsessed with my makeup. I hope you guys enjoyed this little chit chat. Get ready with me. And don't forget to watch my other video where I show my haul. And then my next video um, that will be after. I think by, by then you should have already seen that video. Because I think that video is going to come Tuesday and then this one Friday. So I don't know. But you'll, you'll know what I'm talking about eventually. Um, but I hope but thank you so much for hanging out with me if you enjoyed this video please like always give me a big thumbs up subscribe comment down below and i'll see you in my next video bye